I've been asked why we have two cable car rides on this tour. That's simple. Both rides are quite different and both are just one part of a day's exciting excursion. There's always more to it than just the cable car ride itself. This is the Fuente Day ride up northern Spain's Picos de Europa. This is a wild, rugged country in the land far below. Wolves and bears still roam. But it's not just about the ride, it's about the journey up that Hermida Gorge to get there and on the way back stopping in the mountain village of Potes where we reward ourselves with a steaming bowl of fabada, the local peasant lunch, all included of course. Back up the mountain on that lookout the views across the Cantabrian mountains are stunning. On the Peak du Midi in the Pyrenees everything is very different, just have a look at that viewpoint. In fact at the top is a massive observatory complex, one of a series of observatories interlinking around the world. Sitting slightly apart from the main Pyrenees chain, there's a microclimate where most days and nights the skies are completely clear. Being in the Pic du Midi International Dark Sky Reserve, it also means there's virtually no light pollution to affect the clarity of the night sky. But I get ahead of myself. It's not just about the top of a mountain, it's also about how you get there. Like the scenic drive up here, the Col de Tourmalé, and the very strange creatures you meet on the way like rounding a bend into a pack of llamas. Meet my good friend. There we were having a simple face-to-face -face chat when my wife called out, smile. It was so funny because not only did I turn to face camera and smile, so did the llama. Look at his big cheesy smile. This is one of the other strange creatures you'll see as we drive up the mountain. You see, the Col de Tourmalé we're on is also one of the pivotal, arduous, famous mountain rides in the Tour de France. It's 18 kilometers long and averages averages 7.7% incline. I can see you bike riders out there wincing at that. So as we drive up the mountain pass, we keep passing these strange and tragic figures. Day riders puffing and panting and straining and pushing themselves, imitating the heroes to later flop exhausted at the top of the pass, which is where we jump on our cable car to ride up to the top of the Pic du Midi de Bigorre, nearly 3,000 meters high, into a world where the sun shines nearly every day of the year, and the views up and down the Pyrenees go on forever. There are lookouts all around the observatory, a 360 degree panorama, and don't forget that overhanging cantilevered lookout where the world drops away far beneath you. There's a lot to do up here. Inside the complex is a fascinating museum of astronomy and they tell the inspiring story of how they hauled the first observatory up here by hand, a mule, way back in 1878. Time to enjoy a snack in the cafe or lunch in the restaurant or just grab a deck chair in the chill, crisp, clean mountain air.